Welcome to another video. Today, as you guys know, I'm actually taking everything out of my boat. If you guys watched the last couple of videos where I pranked my dad, absolutely loaded the boat up with all my tackle. Then the next video, I actually had his reaction. You guys loved it, you guys blowed it up. I mean, it has over a thousand likes on it. The views are going up. It's absolutely insane. I'd like to thank you guys so much for that. That was phenomenal. So in today's video, I'm actually gonna be cleaning up all this tackle out of my boat. I'm gonna be taking every single thing I own in every single compartment, taking it out and laying it all out, showing you guys what I have, showing you guys why I have it in each compartment. That's what we're gonna be doing today. I want you guys to stay tuned for Tuesday because I'm doing a full on boat tour. You guys have asked for an updated boat tour for such a long time now, and that's what we're gonna be doing. Guys, the first step to this video is to obviously get the tackle that I absolutely dumped in the boat for that other video that I made for you guys. That was absolutely hilarious. If you guys haven't checked out the prank, be sure to check it below. I'll leave the link below. This is a must watch, guys. It's probably one of the best videos on my channel. You guys are sure gonna get a laugh out of it. And my dad's in it. I know you guys love my dad, so go check it out. thing I would like to say before I actually fill this box right here I am going to be giving away a lot of this tackle and I'm going to have that at the end of this video so be sure to watch this all the way through and check that out at the end of the video and also drop a big like let's go ahead and fill this box up so as you guys can tell in the, in the last freak out video my dad took like everything out so I'm pretty much throwing it back in I gotta clean out all these compartments but I have to get all this in here first Take a look at the mess in all the compartments. Open up all the compartments. It is an absolute mess, guys. As you can tell, there's just that stuff's everywhere from the national championship all the way to, you know, traveling back home. It has just been an absolute mess. And of course, me pranking my dad. If you haven't checked out that video, be sure to check it, check it, check it below. Pretty much, I'm gonna be organizing all these. I'm gonna take all the stuff out and I will catch you guys on Tuesday's video where I organize it, but in just this one, we're gonna be taking everything out and I'm gonna explain pretty much what I have in each compartment. In this one right here, we actually have pretty much gloves, hats, and then we have an extra trolling motor cord. Um, we have like a med kit, pretty much all that's right there. This next one, you know, I have some shoes that are actually waterproof, I have rain suits, and also some safety equipment in there. Then of course, in the middle compartment, I actually have, you know, a mass majority of my baits. You know, I want to have all my soft plastics just about. I got crankbaits, um, I got all the shaky edge jigs, all the terminal tackle. That's pretty much in this middle compartment. Then obviously right here is my rod locker, but I kind of, you know, uh, prank my dad. So that's a little, that's, that's, it's just a tad mess right now. Just, just a little bit. But that, that's absolutely destroyed. But we're going to clean up today, so that's okay. And actually, you guys are going to get a lot of that tackle in the giveaway at the end of this video, so stay tuned for that. Moving on to the back. This one is actually for my co-angler. So if I'm having somebody in a tournament, my fishing partner, and I want to have some room for them in the boat, I usually leave this empty. You know, 95% of the time, I'm going to have this pretty much empty. I also have a weigh-in bag in here and uh, also proper inch. Um, it's just a little face shield and that's pretty much all I got in there I have nothing to show you in this back compartment I pretty much have all the baits uh, I have some more baits in here as you can tell that's a box that I organized in one of my latest videos you guys can check that video out link will be below um, I also have some snacks in here for nationals that we just threw in here because we we're in such a rush also have some Mountain Dews right here one thing one little quick tip if you guys didn't know if you cut a fish in the back of the throat and it starts bleeding 
if you pour Sprite or Mountain Dew down the back of his throat, it will actually close it up and it will stop bleeding. All the, uh, you know, acidicness to it is gonna actually close the cut up. That's a little quick tip. Cue the time lapse right now. All right guys, just got the first compartment absolutely finished. It is horrible in there, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you, it is absolutely super, super, super dirty, as you guys can tell. I mean, it's filthy. But I haven't done an absolute deep clean. By deep clean, I mean taking everything out of the boat and absolutely, you know, hosing it down, rinsing it down since probably about last summer. So it's been a little, a little less than a year since I've done that. So that's something that's gonna be coming up next. Um, I'm, I'm not I'm gonna do that off camera because I doubt you guys really care about that But I am gonna be deep cleaning this boat. That's the reason I'm taking all this tackle out um, But next on we're going over to this compartment right here All right guys all the compartments are actually clean completely emptied out even the couple in the back back there are absolutely Done cleaned out. I left the weigh-in bag and that minor stuff got all the tackle down here Absolutely insane guys. I had a lot of stuff in this boat. I mean, I had a lot more than I usually would, but I definitely had a lot of tackle in here. All the rods and all the, you know, stuff like rod gloves, maps, life jackets, that's gonna be cleaned up. That's gonna be taken out of here. I don't wanna bore you guys. I don't wanna like go into that deep detail on cleaning the boat, wiping it down, that whole deal. That's where I'm gonna leave it with just cleaning out the compartments. Here's all the tackle guys. That's a close up shot. Tons of stuff I pulled out of the boat. This is what we're gonna be doing. I said that we're gonna be doing a giveaway in this video, so that's what I'm going to do right now. I'd like to thank you guys so much for the support. That's why I do these giveaways. You guys support me on the videos. I support you with the giveaways. I, you know, a lot of you guys don't own too much tackle, and that's why I love you know to do these. And obviously, I have a lot of tackle, more tackle than I can actually handle. So I'd love to give to you guys that don't have much. So this is what we're gonna do. As you know, I pour off all that tackle into the boat. It's a lot of stuff I don't use as much, and it's a lot of good tackle still. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take $500 worth of tackle. I'm gonna add it up. It'll probably be around about that much tackle around five hundred dollars worth i'm gonna split it in half 250 250 and pick two winners now this is exactly what you're gonna have to do you're gonna have to one like this video two comment below on what videos you want to see next and three subscribe and hit that little bell and if you could please go follow me on instagram at kicking their bass tv i'll pop it up here on the screen and uh, I post content every single day on there so you can go check it out on there. But overall, guys, thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out my dad's reaction video if you haven't checked it out. Be sure to stay tuned for Tuesday because I'm actually uploading a full-on boat tour that you guys have been waiting for forever. Thank you guys so much for the support, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thank you.